hey guys welcome back to the channel so in today's video we are filming the long awaited and requested big book of fun as they call it um so i'm gonna just do a flip a flip through of like my challenges and i guess i could show you like the stuff before that too it's nothing really serious um just like goals and budgeting draft sheets so yes but before i get into that i actually wanted to show you this folder that i found i've been like okay so i've been like super motivated cleaning and doing all the things and i'm starting to feel it on my body so i'm happy that i'm trying to get as much done as i can while i can um so i found this folder for my son from was he, he's going to first grade now so from his kindergarten class and they sent these pictures so of course the first thing i saw was this picture and i was like oh my god just look at my son he's so big like where is time going i'm gonna buy a frame for this i'm gonna have to wipe it off because there's fingerprints on it already but yeah i'm gonna wipe it off and get a frame for it and then i found these pictures and guess what i did guess what i did <gasps> Ta -da! that's my baby and a little study face he's such a little goof boy i love him I gotta get some uh pictures of my daughter i'm so happy she starts school this year i can't wait okay so enough of that let's get into the big book of fun i just wanted to show you guys like i found it and i got in my bag like super in my bag and it's just like not even the fear of getting old it's just like time is really passing and they're getting older um whew. so I ordered this um, Happy Planner Notebook on Amazon. Um, they have, I think, four other options for covers. So, oh, okay. I know why my screen is lagging. It's because I'm uploading a video. Um, I mirror my phone to my iMac so I could have, like, a monitor to see that I'm still recording because the fear of, like, not recording and not knowing that it stopped recording is real. Um, so, yeah, I got this from Amazon they have like four or five different covers um like different options i think they have one of tinkerbell so i got this one i will leave a link down below and it comes with it doesn't come with nothing else in this book except for some of these sheets they're like dotted lines and mickey mouse head super cute i don't remember how much it comes with i will try to insert like a screenshot of it um at some point in one of these corners um but yes I have so many challenges in here and a lot of them are freebies and yeah someone wanted to know or maybe a couple people i think requested to see a flip through um but one of the people that requested it was like you know you should show us you should do like a flip through so you could show us like all these creators and these amazing freebies so i was like okay so that is where we are at i have my fish tank running smoothly in the background um my my a crackle candle my cup of coffee i'm in a good mood i'm in a good mood i feel very like zen right now and my daughter's in the background coloring on the floor she just had waffles <sighs> waking her up is intense um so i believe i got this from two sister bees i don't remember but i'm pretty sure that's where i got it from um and when i had a different when i was using different rings i think i tried using this as a cover but eventually i just went back to this one because it's a lot bigger and thicker than this um and i did laminate it and just hole punch oh also for me to be able to put these challenges in this binder i had to buy this hole punch and i want to say it was around 30 or 40 bucks it's a little bit pricey for a hole punch but you will need this if you decide to do a book like this um and then also for anyone who wants a book like this made um on my ko-fi i have something called like a special request before you make that purchase just message me on ko-fi and we'll talk about what it is that you want i could get the rings i'll print laminate cardstock whatever it is that you want you send me a list and i can put it together for you i had someone do that a few days ago with the donna powered by creativity a dollar a day 
binder they was like can you just make it into envelopes for me um laminated and stuff because they saw how i had it so i did it and i charged like i think it was like eight or maybe nine or ten bucks um they decided to do 20 so i appreciate them so much like super much um something like this i would say probably like 25 to 30 bucks just because this is a lot of paper and i would i don't know i'll probably do like 75 challenges um that's a lot of paper a lot of ink and the rings as well so yeah i think this is super cool i love how i made it my own so this says budget and planning i just have my budget breakdowns um you know for the next few months because i'm so like into my numbers um if there's any changes like some of these i'm trying to do too early like the 100 envelope savings challenge so if i do them early on the page and then i have some blank paper i have a whole bunch of tracking stuff <clears throat> for all my binders my prop money a bill tracker i got this from the owl saves wisely i believe this was a freebie on a ko-fi um Have my sinking funds tracking in here envelope goals some debt trackers so yeah and then i just have extra paper in the back um so then i have this i created this cover um and i stopped using the original one for a while and i was just using this one um, but then I was like, I miss my pink. Like, this is one of my favorite types of pink. Um, so I was like, I miss it. So I went back to that. But I kept it in here as a divider for savings challenges. And then this is just the extra one. This is also from Two Sister Bees. And then this, oh, I, okay, so I misspoke earlier. Besides the loose, like the notebook sheets that come in you do get i think three the them this is the second one if you believe in yourself any dream is possible i love that so positive um and then this one with these cute little like collage of stickers oh so cute so this just says white binder okay so let's get into these challenges girl wait till we get to extras you have no idea any coffee okay so i finished my um change challenge from jesse budgets so I, I looked for a new one and i found this one so this is a penny saving challenge and you save 210 bucks but it's just random denominations it's not going in it's not going up in increments of one okay so i found this one and this is from uh t nation creations i believe this was on etsy and yeah look at this progress and i just keep all my change in this clear acrylic box it's a little dusty i did some reorganizing i think i am obsessed with my setup right now okay then um let me see so i kind of just so you can see the binder i kind of have these like in order as my binder goes um the change one is just something i do off camera but i do like to show you the progress um so this is obviously a scratch off envelope so it's in there but then my monthly challenge this is from d plans and budgets she made a freebie it was a whole set for like the entire year super low income super cute super doable right and then next would be math that trivia not all of the envelopes in here are in my big notebook but i try to keep it like in order let me see and then next is all things pink all things pink like this is in here so no but then this one is in the book oh um 
Jamaica. Where are they from? This you can find on my Ko-Fi. I'm going to be posting it with volume one um, and then volume two. Um, I can't wait to start volume three. Um, so yeah, that is on my Ko-Fi shop. All Things Pink is from Prop Budgets. And the next thing in here is like this Flamingo Challenge. This is from D Plans and Budgets. A lot of these people either have their links in their description box. Um, they have like a Google folder freebie drive or something like that. And or they have a Ko-Fi or Etsy and Ko-Fi. If they have Ko-Fi, they most likely have freebies there as well. Um, so yeah, I got these, I believe, from her Ko-Fi, maybe or maybe her google drive um so these are yeah also from d plans and budget super cute these are both for this then this is obviously in here then next is sunny day savings and this is from the savings butterfly blog if you go to her website or just go to google and type that in and you'll see you'll find her website is one of the ones on the top and she has a lot of freebies like in my holiday binder i have a lot of her stuff because she has like monthly freebies um so i find like that's amazing and then next is this one which would be this one i don't know oh i was about to say i don't know who this is from but it's from pretty girl saves and then that is it for everything that is in that section because that just holds my white binder challenges so next is games so let me grab my games binder so i really honestly just got this maybe like a week or two ago and i already forgot who this is from so if anybody knows please leave it down below in the description box because i forgot who it's from and there's so many like people that have freebies that i if i don't remember i'm gonna go like insane looking for, through everybody's freebies um because there's so many which is so amazing um so this is called welcome to the circus this was a freebie this is that in and then let's meet at the club um actually i'm gonna put this away you guys get the idea that i just have everything like in order corresponding to my binders because this is more this video is more for the book so let's meet at the club this is on my ko-fi shop this i created um you pretty much just go through a car deck of cards looking for the club suit which is this one and then you write it there um you have a spot to place your amount for face cards which is like j q k um and then the other ones like five like two through ten though those are just that amount and then you it comes with scratch offs but i already completed this once um so i just left the scratch offs the scratch offs off but yeah that's how you do that okay so then this challenge is from donna powered by creativity this was a freebie for when she hit five okay um this was a freebie for when she hit 5k subscribers on youtube and i completed this before a while ago but i love it so much so i wanted to do it again and this is a freebie if i don't say that already um this shut the box is the extended version it's normally one through nine but i got this from reinventing renee and i believe that's the budget nerd co on etsy and this one is very intense do you see these numbers do you see these numbers 49 dollars. oh my gosh um this freebie is from the thrifty sewist it is super cute like not the sky okay phone call interruption um so we have dead before coffee it comes with some preset amounts and then the rest of the cups you throw a dice i'm using a d10 and this is from wendy over at the thrifty sewist then we have love to save each heart is supposed to be 50 dollars, and then you save seven thousand. but i crossed that out remember you can make any challenge your own um and this is from the almost organized owl and i'm using this with a d6 
Then we have $100 Spring Bingo Savings Challenge. This is from the Savings Butterfly blog. Then we have Let's Save 315. This is from Donna, powered by Creativity. Then we have a Color and Save. This is on my Ko-Fi shop. Then we have Save 2024 and 2024 from the Almost Organized Owl. And then I have like a savings challenge tracker here. This goes with my Donna Powered by Creativity um, Ding 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 challenge. Then that is it for games. So here I have my emergency fund tracker. Um, this is from D Plans and Budgets. Super cute. Um, it says cat puns freak me out. <laughs> Seriously, I'm not kidding. <laughs> Um, so if you do all the hundreds, you can save two thousand. If you do all the tens, you save two hundred, and if you do all the ones, you save twenty. So my goal for twenty twenty four is a thousand, but moving into twenty twenty five, it'll be to complete all of these denominations. So it'll be two thousand two hundred and twenty dollars. What an odd number, but that is the goal. And then we move on to my holiday binder section. These little dividers, you can get them anywhere. I think I got mine from Timo. Um, so build the blocks to saving. This is from the thrifty. Shop. This is from the thrifty sewing shop, um, and it comes with one that has like numbers already in it, like two, four, six, I think, or one, two, three, and then one, two, three again. But I'm using the blank one and using a D4. This is for my New Year's uh, savings challenge. Then this one is from the savings butterfly blog. I'm using this for Valentine's Day. This is from the same person um, as the Valentine's Day challenge. I'm using this for Easter. This is again the same person um, using this for Mother's Day. Same person, she is, I told you, she's a, in a lot of my holiday binder challenges. Um, I'm using this for Father's Day. This challenge here is from Glow Budgets. This was a 100 subbies freebie. I'm using this for 4th of July. This is from GNL Budgeting Besties, um, and I'm using this for Halloween. This Blessed to be a Blessing Challenge is from the Almost Organized Owl, and this is for Thanksgiving. Um, and then there's No Place Like Home. I don't know who this is from. Again, if anybody knows, leave it down below in the comment section. Um, but I'm using this for Christmas. This is from the Savings Butterfly blog. Again, I'm using this for my one month ahead. And then let's get into the extras. Oh, let's get into the extras. Okay, so we have at the mall. I plan on starting this maybe is between this and my traveling savings uh, book. Um, when I complete the 100 envelope savings challenge. So here's like the game play and stuff like how to play about the game. And then like choosing your game mode and all the good stuff. And then it tells you all the floors. And here's like the, the thing that you use like when you're actually playing the game. Um, and then here's like a tracker for all the stores. And then I have all the pieces like cut out and put into this envelope. So I'm, I'm debating on what I want to do here. I've really been wanting to start a box saving challenge like that. Um, this is from Books and Finances. This was her August mini savings and then full vibes. I left it in here because the way it printed is just a little bit too big for my ASICs and I'm okay with that. This challenge here is from Bookish Mama Budgets. It's a game and it comes with these cards you could cut out. You could put little scratch offs on them if you want, but I'm gonna leave them blank. And then if you land on the icon like this one you would look for this card and that's how you do that um super cute oh my god and then this one is from kingdom planning super cute game i have the dashboard clipped here this um i think this was like in collaboration with all these people so you have lindsay from boy mom loves to save elizabeth from busy lizzie's budget wendy from the thrifty sewist madeline from madeline's budgets Tracy from Golden Girl Budgets, Renee from Reinventing Renee, Janelle Ray Budgets, Janelle, uh, Jenny from Simply Living Saves, Holly from Kingdom Planning, Ren from Mischief Managed Budget, B 
budgets and lives from Liz and Loss. So many great content creators. Um, and then I have a paper clip, so let me undo that. So there's the dashboard. Here's the goal, how to play. So pretty much you just roll a dice, go across the board, make the little empty circles your own amount, and then it comes with these cards. So like if you land on one of these icons, um, for like the content creator icons then you go to that card and then you just do what it says like how cool is that i'm debating on if i want to cut them out or not yet but i think i'm going to leave them in here it's just easier to flip back and forth so I'm gonna paper clip these back together Okay, so then this, these are challenges that I want to start, um, why did I paperclip this here? I'm so confused. <laughs> oh, okay, so this is just paperclipped here because I don't really have nowhere to put it. Um, so when I want to pick a new game, I will be doing one of these. This is from Norellis Budgets. How cute. She created a deck of card savings. You have like a super low income way, a dollar for each card. This is like the regular low income way where it's like numbers one through five. Um, so if you do the super low income way, you save 52. The regular low income way, you save 124. Then there's like a medium way where the numbers range from one through 13 and you save 364. And then the high income way numbers range from one through 25 and you save 460 bucks. So I definitely wanna cycle through these um most likely when i start clearing out some more games wait take this out and then this i want to start in december of 2024 so it's done by december 2025 and this is safe with judy's 2025 um savings like yearly savings challenge um so this is going to be like a long-term savings challenge for me so i can't wait to start my long-term savings binder then I, if I mess up on paper, I reuse it. So don't mind this, don't look at this. These have numbers from some of my savings challenges. Um, I don't know who this is from, but it's, it's like a would you rather. So let me tell you about my best friend, would you rather. And then, yeah, I, I, I'm gonna try to get better about writing down who they're from, but I don't know. Um, this challenge is from Simply Living Save, super cute. I cannot wait to bring this into play. I just, I love it. I absolutely love it. Then we have a princess themed, like a crown themed princess. Shut the box. I have this available on my Ko-Fi at Princess of Creations Co. I have I Declare War. This is also one of my games and it is available on Ko-Fi. I know it says Etsy on here, but I don't use Etsy anymore. So on my Ko-Fi, I have this available. It is a card game. This flower power is from D Plants and Budgets. Super cute. Then we have Chatty Cathy Budgets. I'm going to leave these in here just because they're a little bit larger. And yeah, I'd rather just have them all here. Then we have Breast Cancer Awareness from the almost organized owl my mom is a breast cancer survivor so of course any challenges that i see breast cancer awareness i'm definitely getting um so super cute you have some preset amounts and then some empty spots i am gonna use a d8 when i get to this challenge then we have dear debt get the buck out of here this is from life over debt super cute and then i used both sides this is from chatty kathy budgets again um, this is from GNL Budgeting Besties. Stitch save 45. So each flower is five bucks. This is from GNL Budgeting Besties. I'm gonna start these in October. I might cut them out and put them in the envelope. Or they might be my white binder. Who knows? Um, this is from Oma Crafts and Budgets. Um, these are from Glow Budgets. How cute! And then I found another change challenge. So when I'm done with my $210 one, I'll jump to this one. And it saves 55. And then this is from Mandy's budgeting journey. This is also gonna be part of my long-term um, 
like savings binder for 2025 i want to make each icon worth the amount for each number the um the month is so like january is the first month so each icon will be one dollar february is the second month so each icon will be two dollars so that'll be fourteen dollars you know going up like that i know once i get to the twelve dollar one it's, it's gonna be a little bit intense but we're gonna get it done So that was all part of that same bundle. And then this is from the Thrifty Sewers. So remember the blank one I showed you in my holiday uh, section? It comes with 642, 642. Um, this is from the Savings Butterfly blog. Um, and then I want to incorporate these two for my yearly long-term challenges. Um, so like I said, the Savings Butterfly blog has one for every month. So this is for January. This one is for February, April, May, June. Um, this challenge here is from Dreamy Budgets. It is a mood savings tracker. You save, you like write the dates in for the calendar month and then you color in the box according to your mood, like happy with color pink and then save three. That's how you save. So just have it in between this bundle because it's for July. Um, so then back to the savings butterfly blog. This is for July, then August, September, October, November, and then December. So I plan on making this white binder here, my long-term savings challenge binder. I'm super excited. I was gonna buy another one from Drift by E, but I was like, I already have enough binders. I, I need to stop. Um, this is also from the savings butterfly blog. It's like a Halloween themed savings challenge. Then honestly, don't remember where I got this from. Leave it down below if you remember. But this is the 365 penny challenge. Um, after I complete the first two change challenges that i show you i will begin this one um so this is save 667 dollars and 95 cents um then we have the savings butterfly again this is a 10 dollar challenge you save 250 from the same person this is 10 dollars a week for 26 weeks and you will save 260 same person again um you save 20 dollars a week for 26 week 26 weeks and save 520 all right, we got pretty much the saving blog for the next three pages. So this is Flowers of Savings Challenge. You save 200. Too Cute Savings Challenge. You save 75. And she also has this in an A6 version, I believe. I'm using it for my beauty sinking fund. Then she has the Butterfly Savings Challenge, and you save 50 here. This one, I'm pretty sure, is from Lisa Gray for Me at the Happy Mailbox Co. I started this once, didn't get to finish, so I reprinted it. So I reprinted it and I want to start this in December. Um, I'm going to finish it this time when I start it. Then this is available in my Ko-Fi shop. It is a fall savings challenge and you save 260. I just created one for Christmas. Um, then we have Glow Budgets again cheap this came in a couple different ways you saw the one that had the numbers in it um this one is the blank one so i made this a roll the dice challenge so when i get to it i'll use a d12 this is also glow budget super cute i want to say this is chip and dale i believe and this is a roll and save and then it comes with a cute dashboard then this is from psyche budgets get boots to her room a nice cute little board game monsters ink themed um, this is from Save with Judy. This is a nice little roll and save, and it comes with a envelope, I believe. Or is this the dashboard? Oh yeah, this is an envelope. We have Teddy Bear Picnic from, from One Frugal Introvert. Every time I say the word frugal, I get like tongue tied. Um, so Teddy Bear Picnic, you just go across the board and save the amounts. And then all of these heart ones are from Janae from Janae from Janelle Ray budgets they come like all different shapes sizes you got some a5s uh, up and down a5 and full size sheets how cute 
um this one is from donna power by creativity this is one that i did purchase um i'm gonna start this for april like a for april um there's that and then this sloth saving challenge i want to say is from i believe it's lisa great for me as well um so i'm not lazy i'm just enjoying saving money um i want to put this into long-term savings challenges as well and start this in january of 2025 and maybe even turn this into a 100 envelope savings challenge where it's not five thousand and fifty dollars i'm saving but four thousand and two hundred um so if you count there's 20 boxes going across and i want to say 20 boxes going down so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty so yeah 20 going up and across ah. so 20 times 20 that's 400 numbers so i wrote a note here how i plan to do the 100 envelope saving challenge is stuff four numbers um for one envelope so since there's 400 divided by four that makes 100 envelopes so i'll put like 20 and then one and then 19 and two all in one envelope so that is on my goal and i also plan on starting the traditional 100 envelope saving challenge next year i have goals i have goals and then that is uh like the back cover that i created and then this is the one that came with the book so it goes with the front cover so that is my big book my big book of fun i hope you guys enjoyed i know this is gonna be a long one but i try to go through as quick as i could if you have any questions down below if you would like me to attempt to make something like this for you um remember i have that special request or custom request option on my ko-fi um the only thing with this is that i probably wouldn't come with this cover because unless you want the book then that would probably be extra because the book itself was like i think 20 bucks or something um so um but other than that i am hungry i need breakfast um i was definitely stalling i have to take my sensor out for my arm for my diabetes and the glue for this thing is like intense i have like skin glue remover but sometimes it still sticks and it and it hurts to pull off <laughs> so yeah now that i'm done filming i'm gonna go do that make some breakfast and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed if you did drop a thumbs up comment down below don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join the princess of budget fam and stay i hope you guys are staying safe staying blessed having an amazing day or night with your own i will catch you guys in the next video bye